Longtime chief of the Bureau of Motor Vehicles, Juana Cabrera Leon Guerrero, facing a federal indictment after a grand jury found that she and co defendant Yong Dae Lee, also known as Ivan, conspired to illegally produce an identification document with other individuals known and unknown to the grand jury. The March 16 indictment says that it was between September 2021 through October 2022 that the defendants intentionally conspired and agreed to produce false NMI driver's licenses. Court documents state that the use was in or affected interstate and foreign commerce. The indictment comes after FBI agents raided the BMV and Department of Public Safety offices last December. The BMV is under DPS, whose acting commissioner Clement Bermudez told KUAM that he met with Leon Guerrero Thursday night after being informed of the indictment and decided to place her on administrative leave. With this Leon Guerrero case, it's a uh, it's a federal indictment and. And I want to respect the uh, the process uh, that's ongoing, and we'll keep we'll keep the community posted as it further develops. He says DPS is cooperating with federal investigators. The chief was appointed to lead the BMV in 2006. She went before a House panel in August 2021 during former Governor Ralph Torres's impeachment investigation in a separate matter. She was asked to describe her scope of work. Part of. Um, the duties are registering vehicles, registering of vessels and jet skis, administering of the written test, learner's permit, and the driver's license. Leon Guerrero and Lee are set to appear before a federal judge on March 20th. Tomas Maglonia, KUAM News, Saipan.